the problems that Zanaco is, is solving for smallholder farmers are essentially three problems. Number one is the lack of having a financial suite of products specific for the farmer. And that we saw was an opportunity for us to be able to go in this particular space. Secondly, the uh, human centered design that was done by our partners through Mercico's Agrifin was that the farmers wanted more information for them to be able to grow. And this information was in terms of agronomic information, financial literacy information, as well as product knowledge. And essentially, once uh, a farmer is informed, then they can improve on their productivity as well as their income levels. And lastly, the farmers bemoaned the lack of rural, rural access points. And essentially, that means that a farmer can open an account or can be able to have an opportunity to have financial services, but they will not have cash in and cash out points. So we saw that as an opportunity for us to uh, leverage from our agency network. Um, I think for us as, as Zanako is to, to glean wisdom from the others that have gone by. Uh, for instance, I was on a panel um, earlier on and I learned quite a bit from Safaricom and what they've done so far. It brought a lot of insight on how we can scale up AgriPay. So there are a lot of, um, you know, we had looked at certain products that we wanted to bundle in, but I'm thinking, wait a minute, why don't we have soil testing first? Or why, why don't we have insurance in, 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 in the first phase? Um, and, and I think for me, it's just trying to see what we can do better and see how we can make our product viable. I'm hoping to meet some uh, potential funders as well and, and talk to them about our product and see how they can be able to help us as well.